That was good, everybody, on YouTube. I'm Riku165. You guys might know me from my past animations, my old fighting video, my old music, my old raps, or my smoking smoking videos and whatnot that I'm about to start. But anyways, right now I'm about to do a technician video since I use this account for a whole lot of crazy things. And right now I'm about to teach you how to root your Hawaii Ascent, or if that's how you say for Metro QCS. I think you could do this with the cricket one, but right now I'm gonna root it, and I got 2.2.2 .2 gingerbread. I don't got the, um, the one that it came with, so let's get started. I backed up all my files, um, not on my SD card, but I used my Metro Total Protection and. I think you guys should really get Metro Total Protection because it is really nice. I'm going to show you guys what it looked like. See, this is Metro Total Protection. It's a good system. Really helps out and whatnot. Alright. This is going to be step by step. This video might take long and it might not, depending on how fast my phone acts. The reason why I'm rooting my phone is because. My phone is type slow, and I think all the models are type slow because I heard that they all got called back because of how slow they was, and the little bit of memory on here too. Because I was just looking at reviews. Mm. So yeah, what I did was open up my OP for my Opera browser, mini browser, went to Google and typed in gingerbreak.abk for share if you wanted to type all that, in, or you can just type in the first part maybe. And then I click the first link. I'm gonna show you guys what the first link looks like on here. Sorry for the glare. See that? The file was uploaded for February 7, 2012. Open it. That's my chart. So now, as it loads. Get my charger ready. All right, I'm gonna hit click here to download this file. It's taking on Linux. You know how stuff downloads on the Android and whatnot, and online. All right, save. Now it's downloading the file, aka saving to. And it shouldn't really take you that long since it's only 295 kilobytes, KBs, or kilobits. That's the same thing or whatever. Uh, almost done. And I guess I'm gonna uh, um, open it. And this is what it should look like once you open it. It says Ginger Break. Do you want to install this application? Allow this application to System Tool, Reading System Logs. Since I don't got to install, I'm gonna install it right now. Now it's installing. Application installed. Open go to file where's that access ginger break uh, please make sure of the sure of the following before rooting you have in it SD card inserted and mounted user debug and enable let me make sure I got my user debug and enable and to do that, all you gotta do is go to um, open my settings on my phone, select my applications, then development, and then and then um check it, and it says this allow USB debugging. USB debugging is intended for development purpose only it can be used to copy data between your computer and your device install applications on your device without notification and read log data 
just in case you guys can't see all that. Okay. Now let me go find it. Let me go find the gingerbread. All right. Missing your it's on your app menu, whatnot. Now let's click it. Let's start rooting my phone now. Huh. And I know this is gonna void my warranty, but yeah, I really don't like this phone now because how slow it is and all that. Now it says it should say it's root device. Click it. And it should say this. All right, so it's rooting right now. Yeah. High school party, see me. All right, so my phone just shut off and it restarted. So I guess that tells me. Let me make sure I'm right. Alright, so it says once my phone shut off and it comes back on, it means it's rooted and I'm going to make sure to check because I'm going back to Gingerbread to see if I can reroute my phone. But yeah, this phone got a long behind turn on. Stays at this screen for a second. Metro PC. Oh, well, it says Hawaii or how you see the phone. Then go to the Metro PCS screen that says Metro PCS. Wow, this phone, oh, hello, hello, and all that crap. Then makes you wait a good few seconds, like a good minute, I guess. You type Dustin. They're waiting. By the way, if you guys want to buy this phone, um, contact me. Cause I am selling this phone mad cheap, cheaper than you can probably find on eBay. The problem is that I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you guys the problem right now. There's no like the hard cover for the um, charger port and the headset jack, but it still got the cover on it. There's a few scratches and whatnot. The back falls off, but if you're safe and just hold your phone like this, you're good. The volume up button is broken, but the volume down is fine, but you can still use it. The volume down button, if you gotta turn up your volume, just go to your settings. Um oh yeah, and the SD card hard cover is missing, but the plastic cover is still there. And now my phone's about to turn on. Yeah. And I'm selling this phone with the phone. Um, probably the original box. If I, this is the old box, I think, not the original one, I think, and the charger. So if you guys want to buy it, just contact me. I now my phone is on. Can't hold my memory. Oh. Open up gingerbread just to see. So it's loading. Check out the super user. It just takes so long. I don't know why. Alright. Super user request to follow app is request super user upgrade. I guess I hit allow. Alright. And yep, 
my phone is rooted and it gives me the choice to unroot my phone. So yeah, and this is how you root your phone. Let's you check out my settings. Oh yeah, and it gives you an app called Super User 2. Uh, right there. This is what I about my phone. I guess it's that is. I don't see nothing different. But okay. So yeah, I'm gonna learn some more stuff about my root, my rooted phone, and probably tomorrow later on I'm gonna come back to y'all on how to change the speed and all that probably. But yeah, this is how to root your phone step by step. Remember, um, get your phone. Open up your browser, either use Opera mini browser or I guess you can use Dolphin. Go to Google if you want to. Um, type in gingerbreak.abk for share or just gingerbreak.abk. I suggest you put for share just to get there faster. Click the first link, it just says um, all that. It was uploaded February 7, 2012. I think I said 295 kilobytes KBs. Download that one. Once it's done downloading, it should um well once you hit download file, it should even say save. I guess if you're using Opera Mini Browser, save it, let it and save it to your SD card. Then hmm. <laughs> my bad. Alright, then open it, install the app. Make sure you have your user debugging on. If you don't know how to go over there, go to your settings, select application development, user debugging, then open up Gingerbreak and root your phone. And that's step by step. So, yeah, I'm out. Peace out.